Hello, and welcome. I'm Zinder, and we have a pirate supply cache, and I am intentionally parked far away. There's also another one over there. So I've removed the, uh, the neutral, like, crashed cargo ships thing, because that's all I was getting. And... Pretty much, when I got to the point where I found a small ship that was composed of over 6,000 blocks, according to the uh, blocks to grind, I was like, you know what? This is dumb. Now, supposedly, you can open these, you just have to figure out the right button, or it'll explode and kill me. It might still explode and kill me. No? Well, isn't this terrifying? I bet you it. What? What? That disappeared awfully quick. Look, I know I'm. Whatever. Well, guess I'll never know what was in it. Yeah, okay, but there's supposed to be warheads involved with this. And I'm going to... So anyhow, because of that ship, I may have stripped almost everything out of this that was a production thing and filled it with build and repair systems. Yeah. So now, if I get closer like so, I hope this is safe enough. Oh, might as well land. Turn it on. Now I put in this monitor here, because I figured it was easier to see, plus I left it on... Well, they both only stay due to the way the script gets edited. So there's 129 blocks to grind. Whoa. Oh. Oh, that's why there's a bit of lag. Yeah, so I put in what is basically air pirates as well. I wonder, is it the same button on the other supply cache? Or is there multiple variants? Hmm. What do you mean blocks to grind null? What do you mean blocks to grind null me? Oh, you're just currently grinding null. That was it. Weird. I really don't want to deal with a flying ship while it's dark out. So, we're actually just going to go hit up that other supply cache. I, I apologize for that. That was the brightest thing ever. Fourteen. Zero. Okay, very good. Yeah, the thing is, because that script updates every five seconds, I think I have it set to... It's not... It, it obviously doesn't update very quickly. So let's try... This one. I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna rant, uh, land about 100 meters out. Trait! Trait. That was a trait. I think this thing needs more braking thrust. Apparently, uh, two small atmospheric thrusters is not very strong braking thrust. But at the same time, I do just want to, like, rebuild the ship entirely. I might use this one as a basis for whatever new ship I make. I made a small ship, then I deleted the small ship, that was a thing that happened. Wow. A 
All right then. Unexpected. I have no idea how long it's been dark. So that's a thing. I say that because I want to go deal with the pirates. But it's going to be a bit hard to do that. If I can't see anything. See those sparks? That's slightly concerning. And I believe I put one of those 300 millimeter. Yeah. All the ammo I had made is in the cannon. I made some HEs. I do kind of want to see if, instead of taking out his guns, if I can just blow out whatever propulsion it's using and then clean up the, uh, the debris that's left when it falls out of the air. It's getting farther away, though, and it may despawn soon. And I don't want to leave debris out here because that can cause issues from this, so I guess I'll let this break down and then try and catch that ship. Because if I can get a decent angle under it and get close enough to be able to shoot out its thrusters, I might be able to cause it to fall down. But at the same time, it might despawn before I get there. If I can get within 800 meters, the way the mod's set up, it won't despawn, but at the same time, 800 meters is weapon range. Although most weapons default to 600, so I might be safe enough to get close. Come on, finish off the last few... F last foo... F last foo? Okay. This is none. Very good. Screw it. I, most of my components are in the base. I can rebuild a new ship if I have to. Whoa. Another supply cache? Eh, I'll worry about you later. Seems by removing the planetary crashed cargo ships things, more pirates are spawning. But unfortunately, it's been three supply caches in a row, which is not what I wanted. They're not terribly interesting. And out of simplicity, I might just sh come back, shoot with a laser gun, cause it to explode. And then just harvest the tiny bits left. Because you don't even get much out of harvesting it. I mean, you get some radio communication components. I got some elite weapons. What do you do? I'm half expecting to get here and have it despawn on me. Like, right as I'm getting close. Can I see it? I cannot see anything. <sighs> Maybe if I get closer, I'll be able to see something. This would be the perfect time to have installed a script that I grabbed. Oh, and I uh, I vaporized the little like dune buggy four wheelery thing because it uh, it kind of bugged out a lot. Where are your thrusters? I don't see anything. You know what? Here's hoping it'll fire those first. The 
defense installation. What size are you? I can't tell. Oh, jeez! Okay. How much damage did I take? Did I lose anything? Whoops. Wrong button. Wrong button. Ship and okay, I assume that's debris. Whoops, did it again. Okay, that should, in theory, be enough for it to fall out of the sky. Do we have any HE ammo still in it? Oh, it's using the AP rounds, even though I put the HE in. That's no fun. Okay, let's see if we can locate any other weapons on this. Miss. Too fast, too fast, too fast. Hello there, friend. Don't you autopilot enabled me. So I don't have enough thrust to hold this ship up. Oh yeah, things are spawning everywhere now. Okay. We're going down. 351 blocks to grind. As it grinds it down, hopefully we'll be able to stay more and more up in the air. I am repairing parts of my ship by getting what I harvest off of it, so that's good. 225 blocks to go. Currently I... Oh! What was that? Did we lose anything? Nope. But it is now falling like a rock. Turn this on. Gotta go down here and get the debris. Whoa! Really? Really, parachute? Okay, there we go. Turning that off forcefully st causes it to stop. Oh, I've caused so many tiny pieces of debris down here. This is awful. Okay, if I can get close enough to the ground, it should slowly scoop all of them up. So here's the question. The question. I forgot the question. Right. I remember the question again. So I managed to uh, fix it pulling from the build and repair system, by the way. Uh, in the programmable block... No, not you. 
uh, this. Scan equals welders. These count as welders, apparently. And it doesn't scan welders, grinders, and drills by default. Or is it connectors? I don't know. Anyhow, it doesn't scan things by default, certain things, and one of those being welders, so I had to tell the script to intentionally scan welders. Let's get lower here. Did a piece of the ship end up inside of the terrain down here? Okay, to say there's any more small ships floating about, no. Cool. Let's go have a look at a defense installation. Looks like the sun's on its way up, by the way. Because I can see light on that mountain there. Whoa. I'm having issues getting this to fly in a straight line for some reason. Look at that. You see that? Both thrusters there. All those thrusters. All of those thrusters. Is there a piece of debris in my ship? What is going on here? If I leave it alone, what does it do? It came to a stop. There's not like a drone or something attached to my vehicle, is there? No, because it'd be coming up on the radar if there was. And any sort of enemy debris should have already been picked up. Oh god. Don't get in range, don't get in range, please. I can't see a damn thing. Turret? Turret, were you shooting at things automatically or something? It shouldn't have been, not everything is disabled. Oh god, wrong button, wrong button! But where is it? Wrong gun! Oh god. This is a problem. Uh... If I take one stray bullet, I'm dead. And I'm dead. How much is left of the ship? Ah, uh, they got the land. They got the. Uh, they got a little bit of everything, actually. Oh, hmm. The radar dome is still active. I wonder if it safely, more or less, crashed the ground. I don't have any way over there. And that. Is how I lost the ship. Well, I think the next one's gonna have shields. I built a little bit of a. I always run into that glass. It is actually clear enough now that I don't even see it. I got a little bit of a platform out here. So the question becomes what do I build?
because everything I start building, well, should be in range of the build and repair systems in there at least. So we'll start with a landing gear. I'm on. There we go. I just didn't want to start building anything before it was locked. Yeah, yeah, you're going to give me performance issues. Oh, wrong button. Sim speed is still showing a nice handy 1.0. Uh, some of these blocks may not be in range. It's going to be hard to tell. So we're going to need room for... Lots of build and repair systems to strip things down. When at least a couple shields, I think. And I think it's time to make use of another mod I have in place. Because obviously I'm gonna need to power all of this somehow. Oh no, I lost all that uranium. Okay, powering this is gonna be a little bit more difficult. How big do I want this to be? I think at least seven wide should be good to start, right? You can always adjust later. I ran out of hydrogen. I might have to produce some hydrogen bottles so I can work on this in peace, at least for a little bit. Production. Uh, tools, hydrogen bottles. And I don't have the script on here to automatically craft anything I need, so I'll have to end up crafting things by hand. That won't be fun. So question, where did you go? Went into the oxygen generator. Eh, close enough. And this is where having this comes in handy. Had to move the chair. It was uh, in the way of getting out of the ladder. Well. If everything didn't go wrong... How can I make everything go right? The question is, did it keep shooting it? I don't see its radar dome broadcast. I don't see anything. I see that. I don't see anything else. That is slightly concerning, because there was things out there. And they should not be far enough away to have despawned. Okay. Locating a supply cache out that way. Supply transport up to... Hello? I think that was something else spawning. Uh, what is... Uh... So there, I assume, is the defense installation. There's two defense installations. Looks like there's probably at least a li Stupid chair. Uh, there should be at least a little bit left? I think? I hope I have enough materials for these things. I kind of want to go... I want to make sure that I stay flank. You know what? I can't... I can't stop. 
I want these to be out a little bit so I can build some armor around them. I think it might need to be longer if I'm going to go with these. Although I'm going to be out of range of the boat and repair system pretty quickly. Three blocks away. Yeah. Whoops. Too many blocks. I think I might be almost out of range. I'm also concerned I don't have enough motors to build all of these. Two of them, and it looks like they might be working on the thrusters first. Okay, so I think maybe one large thruster facing back. That needs to get out of the way. And then here, here, here. Uh, which size do I want? Anything more than times three, I think, is going to be too much. And then, conveniently, I already have them on the bar. I'll be able to set up some chains of these here. How many do I want? There's more or less a gunboat and scrapper sound. You're not right. Please go away. Also, go away. I forgot to turn off auto rotate. I need. Those are just conveyors. Just access it from up here. Build and repair system, what do you need? Motors? That is a lot of motors. Um. Wait. What? You see that? Is it just not running? Group repair systems, group. Empty slash wrong types. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was it that, I think? Timer bar. You are set to run. Is it just that this wasn't updated? What's going on here? Uh, 
and that has all the assemblers. Why is this not functioning? Fatal error, group repair systems, group empty slash wrong types. Excuse me? Oh, first of all, it's just called vote and repair group one. There we go. That's better. Okay, so it should have... Yep, evenly split them among all assemblers in the base. Oh. And there should be... Actually, there probably shouldn't be. Yeah. There's no tools in the base. I got, I got these on me. Let's do this. So you're done. You're done. You need 678 motors. Oh yeah, it must have toned the number of motors in these down with the uh, thruster rebalance mod. To make it more in line with the uh, small thrusters. Anyhow, I'm going to keep working on this and hopefully get it built, and then we'll go get our revenge back next time. So, for now, I'm going to call this good, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.